Hey. Oh, hey, Margo, what brings you here? Uh, you. Have you heard from your cousin lately? Um, something about Adam? No, I haven't heard from him. Hmm. Where do you suppose he might have gone to, huh? Well, my first, uh, bed, I checked with Abigail. Well, oh, I guess she already did that, or you wouldn't be coming here looking for me, huh? So is it good news or bad news? That depends on who's asking. Listen, would you please do me a favor and pass along a message if you do hear from him? Yeah, well. Tell him that Molly McKinney is no longer a prime suspect in the Nick Scudder case. We're looking elsewhere. Bail? Well, that's awesome. If that's what you're going to tell Adam, I'm pretty sure Abigail already filled him in. Well, Abigail doesn't know yet. Look, Adam and Abigail have run off together someplace, and I'm trying to track him down. So, Billy, if you know anything, would you tell me? Adam didn't tell me anything. Come on, I know how close you two are. And I know that you would never break a promise. I swear, I don't know anything about this. All I know is Adam's worried about Abigail. She's upset about not remembering anything about Nick Scudder dying. I mean, they probably went out for a drive or something. I, I wish I could help you. I'm sorry. Okay, I gotta get going. This case is far from close. If you do hear anything from them, please, please call me. I will. And please try and stay out of trouble. Oh, I'll try my best. <laughs> 